we're going to start this off by Psalms 11, number 6. Upon the wicked he shall rain snares, fire, and brimstones, and in horrible tempests that shall be the portion of their cup. This shower of meteorites coming is supposed to rain down on the world for 30 minutes worldwide. I always add an hour to it because you never know. These are not ordinary meteorites. These are ones specially marked by the Lord to strike the wicked. Let me tell you a little bit more about meteorites. Meteorites pass through the Earth's atmosphere at 30 to 40,000 miles per hour or even faster. These fire stones are made up of nickel and iron and the intensity of its heat is unmeasurable. On the other hand, they also can come down freezing cold and that's why God states in Ezekiel 38, 22, and I will enter into judgment against him with pestilence and with blood and I will rain upon him and upon his horse and upon the many people that are with him an overflowing rain of great hailstones, fire and brimstones so fire and ice from above knowing that the brimstones could be hot or cold and is made up of mostly iron and nickel you should know that they are highly magnetized as well as your body has an electromagnetic field around it and the magnometer instrument can measure the heart's electromagnetic injury up to 8 to 10 feet away from the heart. Now let's put two and two together and measure the speed of the meteorites plus how highly magnetized they are and add a group of people running together will most definitely equal a cataclysmic catastrophe. People are not understanding that the Lord is coming back to purge the earth and all its inhabitants with fire and this fire is to test one sin so people are going to be struck through by meteorites so it seems very highly when one is looking at the facts right now in front of our eyes and God does things in perfect order with precision so there's not one meteorite falling randomly they all are marked for objects and human targets 2 Peter 3.10 but the Lord, or the day of the Lord, will come as a thief in the night, in which the heavens shall pass away with a great noise, and the elements shall melt with fervent heat. The earth and also the works that are therein shall be burned up. Shall be burned up. Isaiah 4, number 4. When the Lord shall have washed away the filth of the daughters of Zion, and shall have purged the blood of Jerusalem from the midst thereof by the spirit of judgment, and by the spirit of burning by the spirit of burning Malachi 3 number 3 and he shall sit as a refiner and a purifier of silver and he shall purify the sons of Levi and purge them as gold and silver that they may offer unto the Lord an offering in righteousness by melting the scum away with intense heat and fire Jeremiah 30, number 12 through 15. But thus says the Lord, Thy bruise is incurable, and thy wound is grievous. There is none to plead thy cause, that thou mayest be bound up. Thou hast no healing medicine, and all thy lovers have forgotten thee. They seek you not, for I have wounded thee with the wound of an enemy, with the chastisement of a cruel one, for the multitude of thine iniquity because thy sins were increased. Why criest thou for thine infliction? Thy sorrow is incurable for the multitudes of thy iniquity, because thy sins were increased. I have done these things unto you. He has given you a chance to purge yourself of sin by repenting and stop sinning so he don't have to. Second Timothy 2, number 21 tells us, if a man therefore purges himself from these, he shall be a vessel unto honor, sanctified, and met for the master's use, and prepared unto every good work. 1 Peter 4, 12 Beloved, do not be surprised at the fiery trial when it comes upon you to test you as though something strange were happening to you. Let's hear this woman's testimony. I believe the, the rain that was falling down that was piercing my back. I believe that the Lord was showing me 
that that was something that was going to come upon the earth that was going to cause pain upon the people. When I was crying out to the Lord and I was saying, this is hurting me. I believe that that rain was a symbol of what's coming upon the earth. Rap the news.